this morning this morning. It's still morning. <laughs> uh, well, <laughs> after the introduction to Jeremiah's uh, that I did this morning, um, I want to show you an example of an application that we built um, using the tool. Um, so this is the uh, Tanaka uh, referral management system. Um, now, what is the referral management system? Tunaka is um, a First Nation, or what some people, and the, the uh, non-clean version is, this is an Indian reserve. Um, so it's a First Nation uh, in Tunaka, in, in Canada, near the border of uh, the United States. Um, and what happens, or the problem that it is trying to solve is that once someone wants to do a project that can be just about that can be mining, building, um, yeah, uh, anything, on the territory of the Tunaka people, they will have to contact the Tunaka Nation Council and they will uh, give their opinion of whether that is suitable or not suitable, whether that might uh, or um, affect certain uh, Tunaka values, uh, like for example, uh, to make sure that uh, re religious places for the Tunaka people that they are not, or that, that these projects are not too close to those places, um, something like that. Um, this is an open source uh, project, um, so the URL is on the screen, um, so you can get it on GitHub, um, and well, following this morning's presentation, obviously this is a um, web application. Um, what is the, uh, the core functionality um, is that there is um, a, a management of tasks which need to be done to do this evaluation. Um, so um, basically the projects, they will be submitted to the, uh, to the local province and it will be the province who gets the advice from the Tanaka Nation Council um, and they I understand it correctly that they, they don't even have to follow the advice, but I surely hope they usually do. Um, there is uh, an important aspect in there uh, for spatial evaluation to see whether uh, the Tunaka values um, are um, respected or not, and they need to build a final report uh, for this, which is then sent back to the province. Right, so this is to a large extent an integration project and uh, it is integrating uh, many um, uh, systems, frameworks um, within the Java space. So it is built uh, as core component on top of the uh, GeoMyas uh, GIS framework. It uses uh, the Alfresco, well, communicates with the Alfresco document management system using uh, CMIS. Um, it has uh, support for a, a workflow management system, um, which is in, in our case activity. Um, it uses Chasper reports and my reports for uh, building the final report. Um, it has a link with their local L, uh, LDAP system to uh, for logging in, etc. It uses PostgreSQL uh, to store all data. Um, so this is, to a large extent, process-driven uh, for them what happens. One of the most important parts of the system is the actual evaluation of the Tanaka values. Um, and there is a, a scheme uh, showing exactly what that can be. So uh, uh, at some point, um, it, uh, for each referral, it is indicated which Tanaka values need to be evaluated. And it is indicated whether or not uh, one of the four major communities on the territory need to be uh, informed and uh, whether it needs to be a meeting to get input from, uh, from the local people themselves. Uh, so that's this part of the um, business process. And this is um, one small step. Um, um, that previous slide was this step within the full process where which starts with uh, the intake of the referral and then different handling depending on um, the type of referral, how complex it is, how much interaction there needs to be with the uh, original submitters or the project and or uh, the products. Um, now, let's go to the interesting bits. Um, 
tried to get this to work. Um, I don't need those demos anymore. Um, I'm going to give you a bit of a split demo um, uh, for a mixed reasons. Now, the, the system, um, this one here is the production system uh, from the Nation Council. I can show you some of the interactions, but I cannot make any modifications on this. So I will, for some things, switch to a local installation uh, so that I can do some more interaction with it. But unfortunately, I do not have all the uh, spatial data which they have uploaded in their system. So that's why I'll be uh, switching uh, between the two systems. Uh, just maybe I have to refresh first. First. Switch to that screen, right? So what you see here is the, the uh, boundaries of the map territory. Um, all of the red things, uh, they are
this is not my vote. Um, but I get uh, I can view information. I can just select the referral and it will give me which one, for example, this one here. Uh, so it will uh, immediately zoom to that referral. It gives you information about the referral on this side. I can uh, see documentation. with uh, the uh, information that they have 
based on the uh, uh, sorry, based on the number of values or depending on which they need to be validated. Just switch to this system here to make sure that I can actually change something. So, this is the local installation without any data on it, so it's a lot more needed here. Um, what happens is if uh, something comes in from the province, they will have to fill in a lot of information. To about the uh, referral. Um, there, is, there is talk about doing this automatically, um, but that's not the case yet. Where do I have to fill in data? There's a lot of stuff I can actually fill in. You can see that. Then I can supply the geometry either as coordinates or as a shape file, um, let's just do a shape file if that's most interesting. Right, so I can immediately get a preview of the shape file, so I'm um, going to the next step. I have a chance to actually review what I have entered. Um, yes, I want to create it. Um, <coughs> Now I have the opportunity to immediately add documents within the referral if I want to. I'm not going to do that now. Um, but if I do add documents, they, they will be added into the you know, Fresco as content management system. Uh, yes. right. So now this referral is selected, and I can actually go see in the task manager. And there are there is an unassigned task. To indicate that there is, that the referral needs to be reviewed. So, um, I'll just do that. Uh, actually, need to make sure that the thing accepts the email address before complete. Um, and there are you can, you can enter, you can add some uh, or change some additional information. And for example, you, uh, the engagement level here that's an important field because that actually indicates how the processing needs to be done for the referral. So, so um, it will create two new tasks which can be done in parallel. Um, one of them is determine the task to evaluate. I'm going to say that, for example, three values need to be evaluated and uh, the ontological values. Um, and um, you see here below, you can see a view of the old tasks for this referral, but you can also have a view of the tasks which have already been finished. So, say that, which are some values. Um, just to show you, they have now been the quality of tasks. Um, just to show you that this is actually depends on um, your role. Uh, um, if I log in as an you know, OG evaluator, um, you will see that I have only the tasks which are relevant for my role here. So they will, uh, as an evaluator, you will be typically be doing the uh, doing a spatial search, and it's not all to search in this environment, so I don't have any data here. But as a result of that, you might be adding documents here, or you might be adding comments. Uh, so, and uh, say that. Administrator again, because that's. I don't have to switch as much. Um, <coughs> I need to process a couple of extra tasks now just to uh, uh, make 
make sure that we get you some good and interesting work. So uh, we just confirmed to send a notification mail to uh, the people. We're going to evaluate the treaty values. And then we get to an interesting task, which Something always goes wrong when we do a demolition. Uh, it's the law. Now we need to the task to produce the final report, um, for which we haven't really done at the moment. It could when I tested this yesterday, that's what's on this machine. We'll go back to this one here. Questions? 